So I wanted to, in this video, I wanted to give you a couple little tips and tricks um, when you're learning how to touch type on your keyboard. Um, so touch typing involves using all of your fingers. I know a lot of us just use these two, but it is more efficient to learn how to use all of your fingers. So you want to have your hands on the home row, the ASDF, your, and the JKL and then the semicolon, but in a nice relaxed position. Uh, remember not to rest your hands on your desk or your you know, laptop because it puts your um, wrist in an unnatural position. And you don't want that. Over time it will begin to um, you know, make your hands ache and that type of thing. So nice and relaxed. Remember that the F and the J, the J, J key, try that, um, have these little ridges. So these are such great helpers. Um, I use these to make sure to be able to feel that I'm in the right place on the keyboard. Uh, I do use my pointer fingers or my pinky fingers as anchors. So when you're reaching for, let's say, the P key, which is right here, um, if I were to try to just reach with my pinky, which is the correct finger, it's very hard and I can kind of, it's, it's just very awkward, right? But if I anchor with my pointer finger here on the J key and then I reach up for the P key, notice that these fingers are all off of the home row, but once I strike the P key, I can come back to the home row and I know that I'm still in the right place. The same thing would go for, um, let's say, the B key. I can anchor with my pinky finger over here, and again, you're just kind of lightly holding it over here. But if I reach for the B key, and even though these fingers are moving, my pinky is still here. So coming back, it allows me to go right back to the home row, which is where we want our hands um, to be while we're keyboarding. If you move your hands around a lot while you're typing, then you're constantly having to look down at the keyboard to see where your hands are. So the goal is to learn your fingering, which keys go with, I'm sorry, which fingers go with which keys, and to become really comfortable with that. And practicing, practicing, practicing is the name of the game. Once you're really comfortable with your fingering, your speed will naturally pick up, um, but we want to focus on accuracy first. Another thing to focus on is it's almost like muscle memory that your, your mind, your, your brain just knows where to go on the keyboard. And then your goal is to not look down at the keyboard. You're looking mostly at what you're typing. It's okay to glance at the keyboard occasionally when you need to, but when you have to take your eyes off of what you're typing, then it really does, you have to look down at the keyboard, look back at whatever you're typing, find your place, you know, so it, it does slow you down a bit. So remember to anchor your fingers, nice and relaxed on the keyboard, and um, just practice. Practice is definitely the key. Okay, I hope this is helpful. Take care.